Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome to this episode of Skip Dashing. All right, guys, it is Thursday tonight or today. Um, I've got a shift from 4 o'clock till 8 o'clock. Now it's 4.12 right now. I did log in as soon as um, as soon as it was 4 o'clock. Still waiting for orders. I don't suspect we're going to get any orders until uh, around the 5 o'clock is the, is the norm. But we'll see what happens. Again, uh, we're in... People are in quarantine. Things are shut down. So we'll see how things work out with this shift. Hopefully it's extremely busy. We make some good money. All right, guys, got my first order. Um, not super pumped about this order. I'm in Mackenzie Town right now. This first order is at Boston Pizza in Shaughnessy, uh, west part of my zone, to uh, pick this order up. So it's not exactly awesome. Uh, it's 15.8 kilometers total, and the order is worth $11.05. So definitely crappy, but uh, better to stay at 100% acceptance rating. Anyways, let's go to um, Boston Pizza in Shaughnessy. Alrighty. Okay guys, order was ready to go. So as per usual, contactless delivery. Now this is one that I was talking about yesterday in my live video. Um, that uh, it doesn't say anything from the customer. All it says is contactless. So this would be an example of the delivery that uh, the customer has no idea that it's contactless. So anyways, we are ready to drive. And customer is 11 minutes, 4.6 kilometers away. Let's go. She's in Evergreen. Okay, guys, that order's done. Just left it on her doorstep as instructed by Skip the Dishes. Okay, guys, that order is done. So let's see here. It was $11.05, so $6.95 transit, 410 for tip. And uh, it was 15 kilometers. I started the uh, started the uh, reset my odometer just as I got the order or as I was leaving Mackenzie Town. So it's 5:02 right now. So been on shift for an hour. Um, did not get another skip order right away. I was logged into DoorDash, but that uh, was only till five o'clock. So if I can log back into DoorDash again, I will. But otherwise, it's just skip right now. Okay guys, it's 5.05 .05 right now, just still sitting here uh, after I left that last order and I got another order. So this one's at KFC on Bannister Road, so that is going to be about uh, probably uh, eight minutes away from here. And uh, when I pick it up, it's going to Chaparral Valley. So it's a bit of a long drive because Chaparral Valley is way down in the valley, kind of at the very end of Chaparral. So uh, it's $9.50 and it's 11.3 kilometers, so we're going to accept this one. And the KFC on Bannister Road is seven minutes, 3.4 kilometers away. Let's go. All right, guys, a bit of a wait in there and they were uh, struggling with their spacing, that's for sure. There was a lot of people in there and uh, it's not a great situation. So anyways. Okay, so this is going down to Chaparral Valley. We are ready to drive. Of course, it is contactless, Nicky Nicky Nine Door style. And this is gonna be a bit of a drive. 13 minutes, 8.5 kilometers, let's go. Thanks. Okay guys, like that guy had no idea that it was contactless delivery. <laughs> he comes out and he looked confused that I was getting back in the car. And uh, then he looked down and he's like, oh, there's my food. So anyways, I don't know if there's a better way to do that, but maybe you can, I don't know. <clears throat> anyways, $9.50, 575 transit, 375 tip, and it was 11.3 kilometers. So, we are in the middle of Timbuktu right now, which kind of stinks. And uh, I'm able to log back into DoorDash, which is good. It says they're very busy. So we'll see what happens with that. But currently waiting for skips and dashes. 
All right, guys, I was just getting back to Nando or to my house and I got an order from Nando. So we're here now. The order is supposed to be ready to picked up, uh, be picked up. So we'll go in and grab it. Now this order is worth $11.80. It's 2.6 or 12.6 kilometers. 2.6 would be awesome. And uh, dun, dun, dun. that's it. Nothing really over crazy about this order. It's going to Silverado when it's, uh, when it's um, being delivered. So it's a bit of a drive back to the west side. Uh, I don't know why the orders are so crazy right now, but probably has something to do with the um, most of the restaurants being shut down, stuff like that. So anyways, let's go grab this. Okay guys, order was ready. There's just a bit of a lineup system in there, so you're actually not allowed to even go in. You can stand inside the doorway and that's about it, so. Which makes going to the bathroom a little bit difficult. Okay, so we are ready to drive. And this person is 15 minutes, 12 kilometers away, let's go. Silverado, why don't you come to your senses? All right, guys, we are in Silverado and uh, just getting fairly close to the customer's house. Okay, so we got contactless delivery, but it says some stuff on the instructions, so we know that they've actually changed it. Uh, at the front doorstep of the address, please ring the bell. So that's perfect. Okay, let's go get this person their food. All right, that order's done. And we got another order right away. Yay, Skip, good job. Oh, it's Kung Fu Restaurant. Kung Fu Restaurant, finally a decent order. So next order, Kung Fu Restaurant on Sheriff King Street, so it should be very close to here and it's getting delivered to Chaparral. $11.10 and it's 6.1 kilometers. So finally a decent order. So we're gonna accept that one. And then our previous one. So the Nando's order, sorry guys, reflection's bad. Um, $11.80, $7.65 for transit, $4.15 for tip. Okay, so we are headed to Kung Fu Restaurant. Uh, it's 2.6 kilometers away. Let's go. Oh. Okay, guys, that order was pretty much ready. Only about a minute waiting there. Okay, so ready to drive. This fellow is down in Chaparral. Uh, eight minutes, 4.4 kilometers away. Let's go. Okay guys, that order's done. Okay, so that order, Kung Fu Restaurant, uh, $11.10, $4 for transit, seven ten for tip. And it was 6.1 kilometers, so decent order. Okay, so it's 6.18 right now. We are waiting for orders. Still have two hours left on the shift, or hour and 40 minutes, I guess. And uh, I'm gonna start making my way back home and we'll see what happens. We're at Kinjo. Just figured I'd show you the parking lot here. How empty it is. Poor restaurants. All right guys, order was uh, just a couple minute wait in there. How you doing Luna? You look so serious. Um, okay, this is another one where the customer has not put any notes, but it's a contactless delivery, so we're going to have another shocked customer. 
All right, so they are in Auburn Bay, so they're very close. Seven minutes, two kilometers away. Let's go. Okay, guys, that order is done. Got another order right away. This is at Subway and Mahogany Plaza. It's going to Copperfield. So this is a bumped up order, so it was $6.75 and it's bumped up to $7. So another good order, nice and close. Um, total distance on that is 5.5 kilometers. So this last order, uh, Kinjo, $8.89, 350 for transit, 539 for tip, 4.7 kilometers. So decent little order. And uh, we are headed to the subway, and that is six minutes, 2.1 kilometers away. Let's go. Oh, they let me use the bathroom in there. Thank you, thank you, subway. Okay, so this fellow is in Copperfield. Contactless delivery, and it's got a note there, leave at door, so he is aware. And he is seven minutes, 3.8 kilometers away. Let's go. Getting hot. Pop goes the weasel. Luna, you look so tired. All around the mulberry bush, the monkey chased the weasel. Oh, look at that. We don't have to climb the stairs. Aren't we lucky? Aren't we lucky? All right, guys. That order's done. See, the, the productive thing about this is like you drop the order off you ring the doorbell and before he's even gotten to the door I'm back in my car driving away so like if you do 10 orders a shift you got to be saving a minute per I'm just trying to justify this a minute per order roughly right and uh, so maybe it's like 10 extra minutes of shift time per shift which means you might get one more order. So that's how much more productive it is. Anyways. <clears throat> okay, so that order was Subway and Mahogany. So 375 transit, uh, 25 cents top up, $3 for tip, $7 total. So decent little order. So we're sitting at $59.34 at 6.55. So we've uh, effectively been on shift now for I guess you can call it uh, three hours. And uh, we've got an hour left. Didn't get another order right away. And I did turn DoorDash back on. So I think we're gonna slow down a little bit. Now, uh, the weather is beautiful today. So yesterday was brutal, the day before that was brutal. And now we're in this warming trend. So everything's gotten warm. Um, it's supposed to be beautiful on the weekend. Uh, double digits. I think there's going to be people out everywhere exercising and walking around. So it's going to be interesting. I'm sure we'll hear all about it on the news on Monday. But uh, I don't think it's going to be overly busy now that it uh, it uh, is getting nicer out. But we'll see. People are still stuck inside, so who knows. But anyways, waiting for orders. It's 6.55. Alright guys, just got back to the uh, Mahogany Plaza here and got an order from State and Maine, so just right over here. Um, the order is going to Mahogany, which is great. It's uh, $8.82. Uh, total distance is 2.3 kilometers, so great little order. I'm going to accept that, and it's going to take me about 30 seconds to get to State and Maine. Let's go. Hi Sleepy Luna. Hi Sleepy Luna. Hey guys, the order was uh, about a minute waiting there, not a big deal. Okay, so this, uh, it's a contactless order, obviously. Leave on the front porch so they know what's happening. We are ready to drive, and they are... Should be real close. Yep, they are very, very close. Okay, so they're three minutes, 1.2 kilometers away. Let's go. All right, guys, that order's done. Nice little order, got another one right away. Another mahogany one. And this one's going to Mackenzie Town. So this is ice cream at Marble Slab. Going to Mackenzie Town, it's been bumped up from $5.50 to $7. And the order is four kilometers. So that last order was State and Maine, so $3.50 for transit, uh, $5.32 for tip, total of $8.82, so great. 
great little order. All right, let's go to Marble Slab. And Marble Slab is, should be super close. Four minutes, 1.4 kilometers, let's go. Luna, did you want some ice cream? Of course you want ice cream. Okay. Okay guys, this is a contactless delivery, but it's at an apartment building and they don't want me to come up. They want me to leave it by the intercom, which is kind of weird, but uh, that's okay. All right, we're ready to drive. So we're going to McKenzie town area, uh, eight minutes, 3.3 kilometers. Let's go. Hello. Hey guys, that order's done. She got back to me saying, just leave it by the intercom and she'll come grab it, which is cool. So that's done. That was a good order because it was bumped up. So that was awesome. Got another order. All right, so this next one is at Kinjo in Mahogany and it's going to Auburn Bay. This is a wicked order, $15.06. Uh, the total distance is 5.7 kilometers, so great order. Definitely going to accept that one. Uh, that's awesome. Okay, so we are 6 minutes, 2.6 kilometers away from the Mahogany Kinjo. And I'll show you guys that last order. So marble slab was $7, so 350 transit, 150 top up two dollars for tip so that's actually a really really good order a great order to be topped up so anyways guys let's go to kinjo all right guys that order was ready contactless delivery ring doorbell and leave food at front door thank you very much thank you very much for the amazing tip so don't worry about it okay so this person is eight minutes 3.3 kilometers away in Auburn Bay let's go thanks have a good night okay guys that order's done what a great order okay so I got my notification to end my shift now so I'm gonna end it now and uh, I won't tell you guys what that order was how it was we'll cover it when I get home and uh, I'll be home in three two one Looks like my neighbor's uh, green bin is growing a tree. <laughs> All right, guys, this is how we did tonight. We worked three and a half hours total. Uh, a little bit of a slow start for sure, but uh, it was a good, good finish. We were logged into DoorDash for uh, a significant amount of the shift, but all the, DoorDash, all the DoorDash orders were about 50 cents a kilometer. So if it was an $8 order, they'd be about 16 to 20 kilometers for the driving distance. So um, I don't know why, but they were all terrible orders and I didn't accept any of them for that reason. So anyways, um, okay, so skip the dishes tonight. We did nine orders total. Uh, we've gone through all the orders except this last one. Uh, Kinjo, yes. So the Kinjo one, fifteen dollars and six cents, uh, three fifty for transit, eleven fifty six for tip. So great order, ninety dollars and twenty two cents total, which is absolutely awesome. Home before the end of my shift, seven forty six, and we drove eighty nine point seven kilometers total. So right on a dollar per kilometer. Um, so that's it guys, actually really, really happy with the way tonight went. Uh, we're sitting at about $160 total this week with two shifts and uh, it's good. So uh, today's Thursday, next shift is Saturday afternoon. So hopefully that's a good one. Um, so that's pretty much it guys. Thanks so much for tuning in tonight. If this is your first time here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Also, if um, 
Uh, if you are hitting that subscribe button, don't forget to hit the bell so you get notified when I release new videos. And last thing, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so uh, that helps with the YouTube algorithm. And uh, finally, guys, we do have a Facebook group called The Lighter Side. Uh, feel free to uh, go onto Facebook and uh, look for the group and request it, or you can just click the link down below and that'll take you there. So thanks, guys, for tuning in. Hopefully that uh, everything's going well for you and you guys are staying safe in this time of chaos amongst the world. Uh, have a great day, great evening, wherever, whenever you're watching this, and we will see you next time. Thank you.